Hi Taurus, I'm here to do your reading, okay Taurus? Remember Taurus, these are not personal readings, these are energy readings, meaning I can only pick up on the strongest energy, whether that energy is really, really good or really, really bad, all right Taurus? Remember you guys, every Taurus is not on the same vibration. Again, every Taurus is not on the same vibration, all right Taurus? Okay, Taurus, let's hop into your reading. Let's see what's going on for you, okay? So the first card I got out is bring love into the situation. Aquarius energy. Some of you guys could be dealing with an Aquarius. All right, or a fixed sign like yourself, okay? Maybe a Leo, the opposite of Aquarius here. But bring love into the situation i'm also hearing bring love i'm hearing um miguel um i need some real good loving wow that's crazy <laughs> okay so i'm hearing lord sorry i guess that's what it is okay affirmation so it's like I'm hearing um, it could have been a side piece or somebody from the past, but someone misses you or you miss someone here, Taurus. So bring love into the situation. I'm hearing, I need some real good loving. Because I'm troubled by the things that I see. <laughs> I swear I'm hearing this song. I need some real good loving. Cause there's no, what is it? Cause there's no one here loving on me. Something like that, whatever. Um, Yeah, so bring love into the situation. Aquarius energy. All right. So either you miss someone or someone misses you. All right, Taurus. That's crazy. So, if this is a situation where you probably miss someone so bad or vice versa to the cross watchers, unable to handle your emotions rationally, okay? With this uh, Aquarius energy. So, it's like... Don't destroy a situation. Maybe you power down your energy from someone. Maybe this situation where it can make you feel like insecure or you don't feel normal or like everyone else or like expressing your emotions to someone. Or this could be how they feel about you. Um, so bring love into the situation. Don't demolish a situation or go silent. You might retreat back into your brain for comfort when you should just bring love into the situation. And I also have here, a new start is coming. Okay, so something here. Make sure you guys go listen to that, whether it's you, Taurus, or the Cross Watchers. I'm still hearing Miguel. I need some real good loving. Okay, so somebody loves you or you're just in love with someone and you don't know how to tell them. Okay. Okay. Someone here is not showing their emotions, but someone here misses the other person. All right, Taurus. Let's see what's going on. Oh, hold on, Taurus. 
Let's see how you feel and let's see how this person feels about you. Archangel Michael ancestors, come through for Taurus. What's going on here? How does Taurus feel in this situation, please? Oh, so they miss you. So it's someone you rejected? The number six, not for you. Okay, so you reject someone here. The number six. Okay. How does this person feel? Wow, two came out. Okay, so this person here is deep knowing. The number 43 is here. They have a deep knowing. There's two moons in this card. My moon card is Cancer. Um, or uh, you could be dealing with the Pisces, okay, Taurus. So, intuition is here. This person is listening to within, very hypersensitive. This love is so deep, okay, that they can't describe. They can't describe it. So, yeah, this is probably how your person is feel. I need some real good loving. They can't even describe how they feel. Okay, Taurus. Regeneration is here. The number 46. You could be seeing 444 a lot or 666. They want a rebirth, a second chance. Or a new opportunity here in love. Wow, that's crazy. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what's going on with you, Taurus. Spirit, please come through. Archangel Michael, ancestors, come through. All right, I'll take this. So you're in the King of Cups energy. Yeah, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Strong cat, um, dang. Strong Pisces energy. Strong can Cancer's energy also, okay? Maybe even a Scorpio here. The Four of Cups. The hangman. The six of wands. The ten of pentacles. The ace of wands here in the reverse. The nine of swords is here. And also the Knight of Pentacles is here. Your overall energy is the Nine of Pentacles. I mean, the Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. Oh, Taurus, what's going on? Let's see. You have the Seven of Pentacles here in the reverse. There's a lot of disharmony, a lot of lack of trust here. Okay, so you're not trusting in yourself about a situation. Maybe because someone here left you out in the cold, okay? A mistress left out in the cold. Did I say this at the beginning? This could be a, a third party situation or someone had a side piece. But there was a mistress here left out in the cold. This person could have left you out in the cold and you rejected their offer. Now they're thinking about it. So you feel like.
there was a lot of disharmony, a lack of trust within yourself, financial difficulties. Okay, you're probably not feeling good about yourself, okay, um, because of this person or this situation that you had to retreat from. So, if you were left out in a cold or you were put into a third party situation, this probably knocked your confidence. Someone here is like, wow. A lot of seduction, a lot of deception here. You might not feel uh, as confident as you used to be because of whatever happened in a situation. Backstabbed and betrayed, okay? A lot of people trying to one-up each other. A lot of spying here, okay? But someone could have made you feel like... Um, someone here could have made you feel like lose trust in yourself like body shaming yourself okay making you feel like um too fat too black in a situation something here where you reject a person you had a lot of love here for this person especially with the king of cups and the ten of pentacles here So you could be losing a lot of um, confidence after this. This person really miss you. This person could have put you out, left you out in the cold, okay? I'm feeling a, a third party situation very strongly. Now, I don't know if you were the mistress, but whatever it is, it's kind of over, okay? And you can actually celebrate here. You, you'll be able to get to get the victory great news and hope is coming all right Taurus so I'm seeing here where you left this person you had a lot of love for the person you were with here real love And you don't want to come off as easy. Loyal friends is here for them. Loyal family members was surrounded around this person. You could have been working with this, your lover also. But the Ace of Wands is here in the reverse. So, you wanted this person to fall. There's no joy here because you don't want it. You rejected a, um, a love offer because you could have found out someone was dealing with someone else. So it's like a situation where someone fall, something is ruined here, it perishes, no joy in the situation. You left this person hanging, you reject their offer. Now here, you have been enlightened about a situation. Or the person you're dealing with here could have went to jail or this person can't sleep here. Worried about the situation.
earth energy again okay so you're celebrating the person you're coming in that's coming in they're coming in really slow they're coming in grounded they do want to make this offer towards you okay Taurus there's something here where this person feels like hold on Taurus let's see what's going on clarify this energy wow I picked it up in the reverse so the Empress here in the reverse I, that's just how it's supposed to came out strong Leo's energy okay so someone could have got pregnant they have the six of swords here again well the six of swords is in the reverse so they're not releasing this situation they don't want to release the situation okay Taurus no justice they're not moving on okay so I got a baby mother baby father here yeah somebody is having a hard time okay from moving on all right the Empress in the reverse all right so this is Taurus your energy of course and Libra's energy here all right so this person won't be holding back for long something ended here for this person something was ruined they're not making a judgment about a situation you're not feeling um, as complete as you should, all right? You have been enlightened about a situation where you know this person is not doing good here without you, but it kind of knock your self-esteem. You really love this person. This person doesn't feel protected without you, okay? They're deciding to come to you very slowly. This person is not letting you go. This is not a challenging decision for this person. This, per this person really wants to be with you, but they feel like you could have been telling all of your friends, your business, or your family members here there's something going on here with jealous friends and a fallout all right kind of like you you picture the pleasure but you don't picture the pain okay so this could have been painful pleasure um i'm picking up on really here a third party situation and i'm feeling like someone put you in a third party situation and it made you disgusting someone here left you out in the cold or vice versa here okay to the cross watchers but Taurus whoever you're dealing with they're not over you you could also be dealing with some type of racist neighbor around your lover some type of um some type of fire here also that you have to recover from 
a fire sign. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Leo or there was a fire regeneration, a rebirth, a second chance here. So, Taurus, I'm going to be honest with you. They want you to take action because they don't want to feel stupid when they come towards you because whoever this person is that love you, you have already rejected their offer or something upsetting has already happened here. And if this re person rejected you, it's kind of like, so what? But this person feel like they know that you are playing some type of mind games. I believe you guys love each other just the same. And someone here really messed up. Someone slipped up. So, if you reject this person, you could have gave them, like, strong criticism. So, just pull away. You probably pulled away for one week here. Or you need to pull away from a situation so you can get your self-esteem back up. Or make sure a person is not making you feel low. You're so in love that now you're kind of doubting yourself, maybe. This person already knows, Taurus. This person knows that the grass isn't greener on the other side, I promise you. Like, this person has already decided. The Two of Swords in the reverse with the Knight of Pentacles. This person is already decided to come towards you and get victory with you. This is someone that you have been praying about. You love this person. Because you have the King of Cups. And the Empress. And it makes you kind of like. Ugh. Like I really really love you. And I can't believe you did this to me. Or I can't believe. I'm second best. Or whatever's going on here Taurus. All right, let's see what Spirit wants to say, Taurus. Archangel Michael, ancestors, please come through for Taurus. Yeah, this person doesn't feel protected without you, Taurus. Okay? I don't know if you want to go back, but you feel like someone here left you out in the cold. Spirit come through for Taurus. What's going on here? In Taurus energy. Spirit come through for Taurus. Shadow work. Yeah. The number 18. Shadow work. So Taurus. You guys are mirroring each other. Okay. And you need to accept yourself as you are. Alright. Don't be shy here. Because... You have the seven of pentacles in the reverse as your overall energy. This is disharmony. This is a lot of lack of trust in yourself. Something is going on with your finances. Maybe thinking that you don't look the right way. Okay. One more for Taurus, please, Spirit. Come through for Taurus. What's going on here with Taurus? Archangel Michael, ancestors, please come through for Taurus. Wow, I guess I'll take all of these. Okay, so the number four. You could be seeing 444, authority, okay? If there's not a authority involved, someone here is a boss. Someone makes their own way. 
fulfillment of wishes. The number nine. You could be seeing nine nine nine. A disruption here also. I also have triumph and success, the number one. The universe. I'm picking up on strong um, Leo's energy, Scorpio energy also. Power, the number eight. Okay, so don't be hard on yourself, the number 19. Okay, go towards the light. All right, Taurus, that was your reading. Bye, Taurus.